Hey guys, welcome back to an all new episode of Conflicts. Today we are here at the Robotters International Festival in Texas. Now, if you guys haven't heard about it before, it is a robotic competition featuring a variety of different countries, shown right over here, that you can actually go ahead and compete in a STEM education battle, including drones, RC cars, you name it, it's got everything over here. Now, the day one includes a bunch of competitions, but day two is where it gets quite interesting. That's where we'll be hosting the very first Robo Showcase. So, let's go ahead and check it out and see what it's all about. And there he is. He has it all set up his Robo Showcase. Got his fly banner right here. Rush Order Sides uh, copy. Yeah, sure to yeah. check it out. And I had no idea my brother had this many robots. <laughs> this is all new to me. <laughs> yeah, it took about an hour, hour and a half setting these guys up. They keep going and going and going. So it's real cool, they got this whole setup for him. I'm not sure what the plan is for this trampoline, but I think we're trying to prove that uh, robots cannot jump. So that's the plan here. Aside from my brother, there's a bunch of other things going on over here. Um, they're not set up yet, but I think they were flying drones over here. And then our battle arena right over here. So this was custom made just for this event. So we can play with our ganker robots here. Not only that, but the humanoid robots too. The Super Anthony's that are hiding over there. So we're gonna be trying those guys out in this big arena right here. And I think my brother's gonna be hosting it from this very location. So everyone's starting to come in. We got it going on. So we're here with the CEO of Robotters. Uh, this here is Elijah May. So can you please tell us a little bit about Robotters? Uh, Robotters is a company that we designed to help anybody anywhere in the world who's interested in robots get involved, right? So if you want to play with robots, if you want to learn about robots, if you want to work with robots, we want to help you do all of that. So right now we're working on building out sort of a directory 
for if you want to sign your kids up for programs or if you want to jump into a program yourself, if you want to find a maker space. Basically, if you want anything to do with robots, we want to help you get in and get involved. Nice. Now, I also heard that you guys are building a stadium. Is that true? Yes. So um, our BHAG, if you don't know that term, I learned someone this week doesn't know, big, hairy, audacious goal okay. <laughs> is to build the world's first truly recreational robotics arena. People said, ah, what about this, what about that? Well, uh, there's not a place where you can go and just play with robots right now. And I mean everybody. So you can go play pool, you can go bowling, you can go to golf and play golf. But you can't just go anywhere right now, walk up, pay by the hour, and play with robots to your heart's delight. We also want to have, you know, a makerspace in there. I mean, playing with them is one thing, but we want you to fly them and drive them and break them and then fix them. That's cool. So anybody can just go there and play robots. I mean, that's amazing. Yeah. It's going to take us a few years to build it. It's like a nerd playground, but it's going to take a little while. All right. Well, you guys can definitely go ahead and check it out down below in the link. And yeah, thank you once again. And thank you for having oh, us. Of course. Thank you. And with that being said, we'll see you guys next time. Take care now. Bye-bye.